I've written Buying God to Solve a Problem, which is that we're all really worried about consumerism and we know it's a bad thing, but we're not very clear on what we do about that. So I wanted to set out a story about the background to it, what is the theology behind it, what is capitalism as a context, what is that hardware that software of consumerism runs on, and what do we do therefore to move forward into living better with a consumerist society around us. It feels like it's a really good time to write this book because there is now strong agreement that society has gone too far down a consumerist route and we are ready to hear some solutions. So what my book tries to do is to learn some of the lessons from the world of consumerism, so to think about branding and to think about desire and to figure out how can we school ourselves away from materialist desire back towards God. I hope the book will be of interest to a great many people because it has something for everyone. It has some very complex theology for those of you who are theology boffins. Um, it has some really nice thinking about what we can do to fix capitalism anyway. And it also has a lot of practical thoughts about what is consumerism, why can it be problematic, but also why can we redeem it and how might we do that with lots of practical solutions to that question. In particular, there's a, there's a piece on social liturgy, which is a term that Theos, the think tank, coined, which is to try and explain what is it that we do when we enact our theology out in the world. And I think that's a really rich theme to mine, which explains a lot of what the church is doing through food banks and through a lot of the support they deliver in communities and how we might inhabit that better, how we might do that more purposefully in order to redeem consumerism.